The official car of Ferrari's 70th year is the LaFerrari Aperta, an open-top hypercar with a single purpose, to remind the world that nobody does automotive hedonism better than Enzo's squad. Car Magazine was granted the only officially sanctioned factory test drive for our Ferrari 70th anniversary special issue in January 2018. Read on for our full LaFerrari Aperta review and enjoy the brilliant photography by Stefan John. 8.37 a.m. Ferrari's media offices, Marinello another espresso, another presentation slide, welcome to Ferrari's briefing for LaFerrari first-timers. There are many slides because the LaFerrari is not a simple car. There's a substantial chapter on the hybrid powertrain alone, an alliance of turbo-free 789 bhp, 6.2 liter V12 in mild hybrid care system for a fulsome 950 bhp, as per 2014's coupe. It's captivating stuff and intuitively Ferrari knows that you want absolutely everything, and in forensic detail, the LaFerrari is that kind of a car. As the hands of the clock on the wall spin in double time, I realize that I am getting absolutely everything, and in forensic detail. Exactly when and to what extent the ECU preloads the V12, holding a tot like a sprinter's cabs to both recharge the battery and to have it ready the very moment you are. I learned just how much stiffer the carbon monocoque is than the Enzo's, 27%, though it's also 20% lighter, and the pretty niche pub quiz nugget that around the Fiorano test track dropping a car center of gravity 30 millimeters is worth 0.3 seconds, the same as a 38 bhp power increase. Matteo Lanza Vecchia is the Ferrari engineer tasked with bringing brains less dexterous than his own up to speed. He delights in every detail of the LaFerrari's uncompromised engineering, and he knows the car in his presentation inside out. But he faces two challenges. The first is that the car waiting for me outside is a LaFerrari Aperta, which his presentation doesn't cover. It hasn't had to, there were never any plans to let journalists drive the limited edition Aperta. I will be the first. There are no slides for it, so he must talk me through how Ferrari re-engineered their hypercar to run without roof. In short, repositioned radiators, a new aero package rerouting the airstream from over the cockpit to under and around it, powertrain management systems upgraded with lessons learned from the coupe and a re-engineered carbon tub just as resistant to twist despite the absent roof. And there is another problem. Again, the car waiting for me outside is a LaFerrari Aperta. It is the embodiment of all that the world's most celebrated car maker has learned about performance engineering since 1947. Dedicate decades of effort and expenditure to the art and science of creating extraordinarily fast and beautiful cars, their every concept, curve and cam profile proven and gilded with glory in motorsports most fiery crucibles, and you end up here, with the car so exciting even Ferrari's professionally doer security guards are giggling like school children. Fascinated as I am by Lanza Vecchia's slides, I'm guilty of a wandering mind.